Hey everybody, if you're watching this video, chances are you've gotten yourself into a sticky situation with super glue. Rest assured, there's a way to fix this. We're going to go through a step-by-step -step process for removing and cleaning up super glue from almost any surface. A couple things you're going to need prior to getting started is a bottle of 100% pure acetone, also known as nail polish remover, a couple of cloth rags, old t-shirts or towels that you're okay with disposing of because you're not going to be able to wash or reuse these in any way. A soft sponge, a microfiber cloth or towel, a bottle of household alcohol and ammonia-free cleaner, warm water, and several pairs of latex gloves. Today I'll be demoing this process on a brand new TV that an old tube of super glue exploded all over literally seconds after I removed it from its box. Before we get started with this process, I want to be very clear that under no other circumstances would I ever recommend using acetone or any other harsh chemicals on a TV or monitor as it can easily cause severe damage. However, under these extreme circumstances, it was fully worth the risk as my only other option would be to completely discard the TV altogether. The first step is to put on your latex gloves to protect your hands from the chemicals that we will be using. Be careful to keep a close eye on your latex gloves as it's possible for the gloves to wear down and tear during this process. You do not want to get acetone on your skin. Next, you're going to wipe away any excess super glue that you can with a cloth rag, old t-shirt, or towel. Make sure it's cloth though as a paper towel will not be able to absorb the glue and will end up only smearing it around creating a bigger mess. If all the super glue is already dry, then you can skip this step entirely. Now once you've removed any excess super glue that you can, you're going to take your cloth and add just a little bit of acetone to it and firmly apply it to the surface in small circular motions. After a few seconds, you'll start to see that the super glue is breaking down and slowly loosening from the surface. If you have a large surface area that you're removing super glue from, like I do in this demonstration, it's a good idea to have a dry cloth on hand to wipe away the wet area when you start to feel it getting dry. Remember to use a cloth as the fibers will wipe the surface away much more efficiently than a paper towel will. You're going to repeat this process multiple times in small areas until you get the majority of the super glue off. You will notice that there will likely be a film that remains after the majority of the super glue has been removed from the surface. So now you're going to need to take a small cup of warm water and dip a fresh cloth or soft sponge into the warm water and repeat the process of firmly applying it to the surface in small circular motions. Remember to wipe away the area when you start to feel it getting dry. You can use a paper towel at this point if you'd like in order to absorb the water better. Repeat this process until the surface no longer has a thick film on it. Now the final step in this process is to apply a household alcohol and ammonia free cleaner to the surface and buff out the surface to give it a final cleanse. Make sure you apply the proper type of cleaner for the type of surface that you're working with. You can also use warm water again for this step if you'd rather avoid household cleaners entirely. Again, this is going to depend on your specific surface type. In the case of this TV screen, I'm using an alcohol and ammonia free glass cleaner. It's a good idea to use a microfiber towel on your last wipe down to remove any streaks on your surface. You can see at the end of this process, I was able to fully restore this TV screen 100% back to its original state and install it in my freshly built wall mounted arcade cabinet. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button on this video and be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can also check us out online on our website, www.retropieguy.com. Thanks for watching.